Okay, let's solve this question. How many solutions the system of these two equations has? We have your two equations. This is modulus of z is equal to 4. What will be locus of z? For this equation, locus of z will be circle whose center is origin and radius is 4. So, we draw this circle on argon plane whose center is origin and radius is 4. Okay. Now, look at this equation. Dhyan se pade is equation go. What will be locus? Here, three complex numbers are involved. This is a distance between complex numbers z and minus 4. This is distance between complex numbers z and 3 iota. Now, what will be distance between complex numbers minus 4 and 3 iota? In two complex numbers, ke which ka distance kya hoga? The distance will be 5. So, here we can write 5 as minus 4 minus 3 iota. Okay? So, we have equation of uh, this form modulus of modulus of z minus z1 minus modulus of z minus z2 is equal to modulus of z1 minus z2. Okay. The locus of z will be 2 rays. z will lie on 2 rays emanating from uh, complex numbers minus 4 and 3 iota. Let's draw the locus. We have here uh, 2 rays. This is point 3 iota. This is point minus 4. We will have 2 rays in opposite directions emanating from uh, 3 iota and minus 4. Now, clearly from the diagram, there will be two solutions. Diagram is much more. You have two solutions only. One solution will be uh, minus 4, and the other solution will be uh, this point, point of intersection of this ray and uh, this circle. Okay, now how can we get this point of intersection? Is point of intersection ka complex number kaise nikal sakte? It will be a bit difficult to solve the equations uh, in this form, in the complex number form. Okay. So, what we do? We uh, use uh, Cartesian equations. This is uh, x square plus y square is equal to 16. I am putting z is equal to x plus iota y. We are Cartesian equations. Use kar rahe, okay? And how we get uh, equations of these two rays? Better we get equation of line on which these two rays lie. We have this line ka equation. What will happen? Line is passing through these two points, minus 4, 0 and 0, 3. Okay, so equation of line will be x upon uh, minus 4 plus y upon uh, 3 is equal to 1. I am using intercept form of the line. Okay, now what do we do? We solve these two equations. We eliminate one of the variables, say y. We will get quadratic in x. Okay, there will be two values of x. One value will be minus 4 and other value will be fc sub of this point of intersection. So, this is how we solve these two equations. Okay? Anytime you can uh, move from complex numbers to uh, Cartesian form. Okay? Complex number ke equations ko Cartesian equations mein convert karke solve kar sakte hain. Now, suppose uh, second equation is modulus of z is equal to 3 in place of modulus of z is equal to 4. Suppose this equation hai, then how many solutions will be there? We draw the circle whose center is uh, origin and radius is 3. Okay. Now, from the diagram, how many solutions are there? There will be only uh, one solution that is uh, 3 iota. So, this solution is 3 iota. Okay. This one is the circle ko intersect. Nahi karega. There will be only one solution that is uh, 3 iota. So, we will plotting karke hamara kaam asan ho raha hai. Okay. Let's start the next question. Okay, now let's solve this system of equations. We have here two equations. I mean, we solve karna hai. Kya karenge? Sabse pehle hum locus ko identify karenge. We will first identify the locus each equation represents. First, consider this equation. This is a distance between complex numbers z and 2 plus 3 iota. This is distance between complex numbers z and minus 3. Okay. This is equal to root 34. Now, we check this value with respect to these two complex numbers. What is distance between these two complex numbers? Distance is 2 plus 3 iota minus minus 3. This is uh, modulus of 5 plus 3 iota. Okay, And uh, this is root 
34 okay so we have a uh, equation modulus of z minus z1 plus modulus of z minus z2 is equal to modulus of z1 minus z2 so locus of z will be line segment joining these two points okay let's draw the locus we have here uh, points uh, 2 plus 3 iota and minus 3 join these two points we have this line segment this is a uh, locus of z which satisfy this equation z will lie on this line segment okay now consider this equation we have a uh, distance between z and 4 minus distance between z and um, uh, 2 plus 2 iota this is equal to 2 root 2 now we check this value with respect to these two complex numbers distance between complex numbers uh, uh, 4 and uh, 2 plus 2 iota is modulus of 2 minus 2 iota this is uh, root 8 this is 2 root 2 okay so this is uh, distance between these two complex numbers on RHS we have uh, distance between these two complex numbers so we have equation modulus of z minus z1 minus modulus of z minus z2 is equal to modulus of z1 minus z2 okay so to draw the locus we first mark these two complex numbers we have here complex number uh, 4 and uh, complex number 2 plus 2 iota okay distance between these two complex numbers is uh, 2 root 2 okay now obviously uh, uh, this value will be more than this value because this uh, value is positive so this value will be more so z will lie on this ray z will lie on this ray ke upar hoga na, is taraf hoga. Okay? for any uh, point z on this ray we will have uh, this distance minus this distance is equal to this distance okay? so here uh, locus will be uh, this ray okay now from the diagram we can say that system has one solution it is this okay system ko ek solution hoga jo uh, ye point hoga now we can find this point of intersection how can we solve these two equations in dono equations ko kaise solve karenge we can find equations of lines on which uh, this ray and this line segment are okay now this line passes through points 2 comma 3 and uh, minus 3 comma 0 okay slope of uh, uh, line is uh, uh, 3 upon 5 okay so equation of line will be y minus uh, 0 is equal to 3 upon 5 multiplied by x plus 3 okay so equation of line will be uh, 3x minus 5y plus 9 is equal to 0 okay this is equation of line on which this line segment lie now this line passes through points uh, 4 comma 0 and uh, uh, 2 comma 2 okay equation of line will be x plus y is equal to 4 Ab check karo line ka equation ye aega, okay now we solve these two lines solve karte hai y is equal to 4 minus x so we get 3x minus 5 multiply by 4 minus x is equal to minus 9 we get uh, 3x plus uh, 5x 8x on RHS we will have uh, 20 minus 9 11 so value of x will be 11 upon 8 but x is equal to 11 upon 8 here we get y is equal to 21 upon 8 so this point of intersection has coordinates 11 upon 8 comma 21 upon 8 complex number of this point of intersection will be 11 upon 8 plus iota 21 upon 8 okay na? So, we are using a good combination. We are first identifying the locus using complex numbers okay? and then we are solving the equations in the Cartesian form.